The walking source of infection, this might be the real threat to the globe, as China's deadly virus outbreak continues to escalate. China's National Health Commission warned on Sunday that many patients of the new contagious coronavirus do not have symptoms or only mild ones. An expert says this will make the epidemic extremely difficult to control. There is no treatment for SARS or the new virus. Public health analyst Laurie Garrett says that China's only solution for the SARS epidemic 18 years ago was to isolate all potential patients who are detectable because of their fever symptoms. But this time, it may not work, nor will the fever checking measures taken by other countries, including the U.S., to prevent infected patients from coming in. If the fever is just one stage of infection, but people are capable of transmitting to others before they have a fever, then a lot of these measures are kind of false assurances. We're deluding ourselves into believing that we're stopping the epidemic by taking people's temperatures. She said because of the Chinese regime's cover-up and inaction, the best time of disease control has already passed. Now the virus is spreading globally. I think we're in an incredibly dangerous place right now because we don't know enough about the virus yet to make absolutely certain decisions about what actions to take. China has now put tens of millions of people under lockdown. The effectiveness of the strategy is questioned since five million fled the area the night before the lockdown. Reporting by Penny Joe, NTD News.